Sandbag stations are already open in many of the parishes across southeast Louisiana, including St. Tammany, as residents are getting ready for yet another storm with possibly more flooding along the Mandeville Lakefront. Right, we are getting tired of saying the same story over and over again, and so are the residents. That is where Erica Frando is live with preparations on the North Shore, but it is so important we take the preparations uh, never, nonetheless. Well, it definitely doesn't look like a storm is coming. It's beautiful right now here along the Mandeville Lakefront, but if we do get that wind and that storm surge right here where we're standing could experience some flooding again. The Mandeville Lakefront floods several times a year and every time people have to move their vehicles and their belongings to higher ground and businesses have to close for several days. Uh, it's a beautiful day out today. You wouldn't think it's uh we're going through this again, but here we go. At the Lake House restaurant along the Mandeville Lakefront, General Manager David Hart is getting ready to potentially pack up once again. Every time we get these storms come through, um, we have to move all this patio furniture out, uh, move all of our downstairs furniture to the upstairs, and then we actually go and take the kitchen equipment, unhook all of the, the stoves and ovens and everything move it all on a trucks and drive the trucks to higher ground. Water has already seeped inside the restaurant twice this year and Lakeshore Drive has flooded more times than that. Uh, it's incredibly frustrating um, and especially to be dealing with this this late in the year. I've told a lot of people already we were out. Of, I thought we were out of <laughs> out of the woods, you know. For now, though, it's sunny skies and pleasant weather bringing out cyclists and runners. Perfect, yeah. David Fitzpatrick is enjoying it while it lasts, while keeping a close eye on the storm. It'll be crazy probably tomorrow evening and Thursday as we know a little more. For him, flooding isn't as big of a concern. My biggest problem over here is the big pine trees and all with the wind, and that's a real concern, more than the flooding for, for most of us. Meanwhile, across St. Tammany Parish, yeah. people are already filling up sandbags. We heard it was a category of four, so we definitely knew we had to get some sandbags. We usually don't get sandbags, but this time we decided to. As they prepare yet again. I hope it's not too bad. Hart has movers on standby to pack up the restaurant in case the clear skies and calm water doesn't last. Hopefully this will be the last time this year. St. Tammany Parish officials are asking residents to clear out those storm drains and make their preparations. Now they have sandbag locations that opened up today. They're open until 6 and will reopen tomorrow morning. Live in Mandeville, Erica Ferrando, Eyewitness News. Erica, thank you.